What's up, guys? We're over here on Modern Warfare for the first time in a while. Today, I streamed me playing some Modern Warfare. I wanted to grind out. I wanted to grind for the blue dot for the sniper scope because I've been using the Car 98 a lot in Warzone. So I figured I'd just stream me grinding for it. And today, I was planning on doing a video of me getting Obsidian for the AK-47 since that was my most used gun in Modern Warfare. I have like 7,000 or something kills with it. And I was only like a few games away. So while grinding for the blue dot on the sniper scope, I got to the point where one of the reticles I needed to mount and get like, x amount of kills in a certain amount of games while mounted with the car 98 or just using the sniper scope in general so once i found out you can use any weapon with the sniper scope on it to get the blue dot i used the pkm for a little bit but i figured that was a little too slow so i used the ak and i accidentally got an obsidian on stream uh, i'll show you guys the clip here i swear the second i unpeaked somebody peeked that Right now, we're getting the, the one you have to mount for for the sniper scope. I'm not sure what it's called, but it's just on the way to blue dot. So that was a big oops on my part. Uh, I didn't even realize I got it when it happened. Uh, chat had to tell me. So here's the AK right here. I did get an obsidian. This is my first obsidian in Modern Warfare. I don't know how much I'm going to do. Uh, I was originally just planning on going for blue dot and then maybe working on obsidian for some guns that I use in Warzone. Because I am I I don't think I have the willpower to go through and do every gun in this game. Especially when I have to play 200 matches with each gun, which is just ridiculous, by the way. I don't know. We, we at least have one obsidian. I still think Damascus looks better, but that's beside the point. So then I just started working on the car. I am still like 90 games away from getting this thing obsidian. I don't even know if I want to do it, but uh, I'm going to try to power through. I'm going to play a quick game on shipment since I, I can't show you guys getting the obsidian. I can at least get some gameplay with it. Maybe some gameplay with the car. So I'm going to make a class with both the car and the AK. We're going to hop in some shoot the ship. And we're just going to enjoy a little bit of modern warfare for the first time in a while. Since there's really nothing for us to do in Cold War right now in terms of weapon camo challenges until season three comes out. But this is my progress on the reticles. I need to kill three enemies without dying 12 more times with this reticle. I'm getting pretty close to blue dot but i'm still a little ways away so let me know if you guys want to see me grind for reticles and stuff i figured it'd be more stream content but if you guys want to see more modern warfare stuff i'm down to hop in some multiplayer and grind a little bit for stuff i'll be using in warzone we're gonna throw overkill on let me put obsidian on this we got stim thermite scavenger overkill and amp i think that's a good class let's go ahead and hop in one you can hardly even see it in the inspect here the nuts really stand out on it look at them dangle for whatever reason, this spot on Shoot House, the camos always look so nice. It's probably old news by now, but th this is what Obsidian looks like. It's my first Obsidian, so let's give it a go. <laughs> okay. I'll take that. I'll just switch guns every kill. I feel like that's the best way to try to, try to incorporate both these guns in here. Oh, hit marker. We don't like to see those. I'll take a headshot there. No thermite for me. Oh, I guess I'll take a SMG though. Anyways, we streamed this for quite a bit yesterday. We we streamed it until, you know, basically we got bored of playing multiplayer. So we hopped on some Warzone. Uh, if you guys want more Warzone content, that's just mainly stream content for me. You can head on over to twitch.tv slash jmon3y26. Gonna catch me streaming. I try to stream like Monday, Wednesday, Friday, but sometimes uh, things pop up. And I'm not able to stream. But I try my best to stay consistent. And I miss sniping in this game. I forget how much feed you can get. Like, th this is the game that really... Like, I was pretty casual at COD until this game came out. So this is the game that really sparked my, my interest in, like, camo grinding and stuff like that. Ooh, get stuck. A hit marker. I probably have a bad build on this. It's mostly made for, like, ADS speed. But this is the game that really, like sparked the channel up uh this is where i started making guides and everything i never really made commentary gameplay like this during the game's life cycle i know there's still a big fan base for this game so if you guys want to see like a little bit of mix of modern warfare content let me know but speaking of uh this game like sparking the channel and everything like this is where i mainly made guides on i've been working on the launcher guide and man i forgot how much work goes into those like it's so hard for me to sit there and edit these long form, like hyper edited videos now. You know, since we've been doing like the commentary videos, it's been so long. I think my last guide I did was on the knife in Cold War. Like, I, I like those videos. I, I think like the, the process of making them is fun, but the editing process is so grueling because I like to have like a little bit of what well, I was saying. I, every part of the guide, I like to have a little 
visual representation of what I'm saying. Like, even if it's for like a short, like two second thing. For one part of the launcher guide, I'm talking about using it in Warzone to level it up or camos and stuff count in Warzone. For this quick, like two second part, I had to hop into Warzone, wait around till some sort of aerial vehicle or something came by to take it out. Now, so that took like 25 minutes just for me to get a quick little two second clip and then by the time i get it i i put it in i cut it like just how i want it the, f the very next sentence is me talking about like leveling it up with like a recon contract so i gotta go back into plunder go find a recon contract go like drive or fly to it it's, it's been taking longer than i expected uh to get the guide out uh, i severely underestimated the amount of editing that went into that i've completely forgot you know the kind of work that went into doing those types of videos and back then those were the videos i was solely focusing on so i I would just hop on for a bit i would edit like a section of the video and then that would be what i did for the day now i've been trying to upload daily i've missed a few days because of work or me not managing my time like as well as i could so this video might not be going out when i'd want it to be but i'm gonna try to get it out for you guys i, I want to get as much content out there as possible but i've also been working on some exciting stuff for the channel the other day you know as i'm recording this yesterday uh we played with lego uh, lego unlocked another cod youtuber he's he's crazy he's got all, all like all, everything in the game unlocked like he's, he's just a madman and you know we played some gunfight tournament i'll have like the link to that video if you guys want to see it uh probably up in the corner here and tomorrow the day after i'm recording this uh we i got a little something special planned that we're I'm recording it's gonna be with two other youtubers it should be fun we're gonna we're gonna be doing a you know a, ni a nice little video for you guys so I, I hope you guys enjoy that when it comes out I don't know how long it'll take, but we, there's definitely some stuff in the works. And I really want to get back to playing zombies, but I'm still scared of the, the bug right now on PC that's banning players for no reason. A lot of people are saying that it might be fixed now. It, it, we might be fine to play it, but I, I don't really want to take a risk. But I don't know. Maybe, maybe after a few days or so, we might just say like fuck it and hop on there i've seen people like people are saying it's round 50 like rounds past that that you get banned i've only been past round 50 once other people saying it's other people have been saying that they get banned at like round 15 and then i've i've also seen people go to like crazy high rounds and all that so i don't know i might just bite the bullet and try it because at least if like we get banned we get a video out of it so i don't know but i've also been seeing some leaks for black ops season three like the weapon leaks that i've seen are kind of crazy well for one there's a new launcher i'm pretty sure so i'm not excited about that because you know we're gonna already have to get a dark matter but also the ballistic knife is being added and that's about time you know one of the things i'm most excited for is they're adding a baseball bat i know there's already a lot of melee weapons in the game but those are probably some of my favorite to use and like the most fun to grind with the exception of like pre-buff uh e-tool but it's gonna be so fun just like knocking people's lights out with a bat and i think there are some other weapons there's like an ar maybe an smg I can't remember off the top of my head, but there's going to be a nice new group of weapons coming to Cold War. So for now, until those come out, uh, we might be playing some Modern Warfare, trying to get some reticles, maybe some obsidian. So it should be a good time. Ooh, shipment. I, I can't I can't end it when there's a shipment game sitting right here. So so we'll play one more, one more. They really need to add a map like shipment into Cold War. Like a small map like this would be so fun. I know there's a huge divide between the Modern Warfare community and like the Black Ops community. I don't understand why you can't just enjoy both games. You know, it's the whole COD cycle where everyone likes to act like the new game's awful and the last game was, you know, the best thing they've ever released. But people like to forget about them taking shoot the ship out of the game constantly. You know, huge maps with nothing but doors and the absolutely like abysmal spawns. Like everyone's got their 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 rose tinted glasses on talking about the the previous COD games. Cold War has its problems, obviously. Uh, no one's denying that, but everyone likes to look past all the, all the fun stuff in Cold War. Like I, I feel like Cold War is a, like it's, a, it's a very fun multiplayer. I don't know. I just enjoy both these games. I have a lot of fun with them. Oh, hit marker. But man, I, I do miss the, the chaos of shipment. It's, it's really like nothing else. Especially a, a cranked shipment game. Oh, don't shoot me. People even rock and rose skins in multiplayer. No. Oh, that save your no scope. 
We're kind of racking up some kills for this for this reticle. And I forget these are kill streaks and not score streaks. I've gotten used to. I've gotten used to how Cold War plays. But one thing I will say that is so much easier in Modern Warfare than it is Cold War is no scopes. I feel like I got the centering down for no scopes. Right there was a bad example. You can hit these like nothing. Like you can get consistent with no scopes. Like the zeroing is so easy. The multiplayer in this, honestly, I feel like the SBMM is the same, but the multiplayer in Modern Warfare is so much easier just because the play styles are just, you get rewarded for doing whatever you want. Like as long as you got like decent aim, you can play as aggressive, as passive as you want that's a collateral and you get rewarded for it like I, I should not be rewarded for just running on top of the boxes here on shipment i'm get, i'm just slapping as soon as i say i'm slapping i, I hit marker miss shots and then get skadooshed Ooh, through the flash or people like to you know pit these games against each other but if they still have if they still have like thriving player bases just play just play the one you want to play i don't understand the it's a to bring one up you have to put one down type of mentality dang that was the fast game that game was like what three minutes long that's too bad i forget there's no deaths on the scoreboard you can't get fried for your deaths in this game but anyways here's a short little video for you guys today <laughs> i was planning on getting the ak obsidian but I already accidentally got it, so uh, I apologize. Uh, if you guys want to see more Modern Warfare stuff, let me know. I'll be happy to hop on here until like season three, or maybe we'll hop on here like once a week or something. And do a little more grinding. You know, there's always stuff to do on here because Obsidian take forever. Anyways, that's going to be it for me today. Uh, if you guys like the video and you want to see more, leave a like on it. Uh, you didn't, you don't, dislike. If you're new here, uh, consider subscribing. We're on the road to 100k. Uh, links to my merch store and my Secret Labs affiliate code will be in the description below. And I'll see you guys next time time. Later.